A federal court in New Orleans held a hearing today about a growing problem for tens of thousands of American families. They have filed lawsuits alleging that drywall made in China is defective, ruining their homes and their health. And now some are finding their homeowner's insurance is being canceled because of it. Here's Elizabeth Leamy. More than 100,000 homes in 40 states are affected. What should be a copper wire is black with soot. By Chinese-made drywall that emits fumes so strong they corrode metal. Ate through the copper coil and uh, all the Freon leaked out. And if the drywall does this to metal, homeowners wonder what it's doing to their health. Nobody can tell us if it is unsafe. Is it an unhealthy to live here? <laughs> you, you like all the fuzzy things, don't you? Homeowners report sore throats, asthma attacks, and excruciating headaches. The Chinese drywall was imported during the building boom of 2004 to 2007 because of shortages. It can cost as much as $100,000 to replace it, and corroded electrical and plumbing components may have to go too. So desperate homeowners are trying everything. Many are suing their builders and drywall manufacturers, and some have tried making insurance claims to get compensated. But insurance companies say their contracts clearly state they're not responsible for construction defects. The analogy uh, that we like to give, however, is that if I'm driving an automobile that has a defect, I go back to the dealer who in turn goes back to the manufacturer. Worse yet, some insurance companies have started canceling policies when they find out about the Chinese drywall because they consider it a risk that could lead to other claims. If we don't find a solution, then hundreds if not thousands of homes that are affected with Chinese drywall are going to lose their homeowner's insurance. And without homeowner's insurance, they could lose the homes themselves. Elizabeth Leamy, ABC News, Washington.